Hey yo, what is going on everybody? It is your boy Twitch here guys. Welcome back. Hope you guys are all doing absolutely fantastic today guys. And yeah, we're here with another GTL video for you guys. So let's go ahead and get into it. Today, we're going to be going ahead and reviewing the watermelon flavor. I have not reviewed this flavor in like four years. I reviewed this, I believe back in the summer of 2020. But I feel like this is one of the GTL flavors that is well overdue for a re-review on my channel overall the tough design looks immaculate does a very good job at representing what the flavor is um you got the watermelon text there all that good stuff right there um sugar free 15 calories nothing's really changed with the formula um supplement facts there you go i feel like that's relatively important to show off um obviously you got your 140 140 milligrams of caffeine all that good stuff within the g fuel so um yeah watermelon g fuel definitely is one of the original flavors um i would say this is no i'm almost certain that this is like one of the top 10 not top 10 but the first 10 G Fuel flavors. I'm pretty sure this is one of the original 10. Um, I call it the original 10, but they're pretty much all the like, you know, one note flavors like grape, pineapple, stuff like that. I don't think pineapple was an original 10 though. I digress. Um, watermelon is just one of the OGs. Everybody knows and loves it. Um, it's obviously a one note flavor. So we'll get into my thoughts on that here in a second. So. Um, let's go ahead and open this top right up guys We're gonna have to take our scoop out here. I don't have a cup ready yet But we will get that ready in a second. So i um, taking a look at the top powder um, Hopefully you can bring this a little closer um, The powder come on is white um, Pretty generic G fuel powder um, so we're gonna go in for a smell test here. Um, I don't really, uh, I'm gonna hold that thought. Let's go in for a smell test. Yeah, yeah it, 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 it's, it's watermelon. Um, how do I explain what this watermelon smells like? Because it's, it's definitely not a natural watermelon smell. It's it's definitely heavily artificial. Um, you're definitely getting a heavily artificial watermelon smell. Um, it's definitely like a candy watermelon all the way through. Oh, oof. Um, I get no semblance of like natural watermelon, but honestly, that's kind of what you're getting. Like it's, you're not, I don't know. I feel like when you're going with G Fuel, you're not necessarily going for natural flavors, but I don't know. Yeah definitely smells like a candy watermelon but I can't really specify which one so we're gonna go ahead and grab a scoop of the watermelon flavor we're gonna set this off to the side actually because I gotta go get a cup ready and we will be right back alrighty guys so we are back with the water and the ice we got our cup ready today we're using the spider Gwen shaker cup from across the Spider Verse, from the across the Spider Verse collab. Um, never mind. <laughs> I'm dumb. We got our scoop ready right here. We're gonna go ahead and pour this bad boy in. Um, most for for most of my G Fuel tubs, I take the I take the little cap off of it. I rarely ever need it, so I usually just keep them off. So, most important part, can't forget this. Never, never. So yeah, let's go ahead and screw on the cap. Gotta make sure she's tight. Oh. She dripped on me. A little bit too tight. Let's go ahead and shake it up. Let's get it. Alrighty guys, so we're ready and shaking up here. So this is the color that it made on the bottom. Um, pretty much just a nice pink color. Um, yeah, this is the watermelon color that's actually pink. The other watermelon flavors I feel like are a lot of other colors, not pink, but 
Anyways, let's go ahead and get into the smell test here. Yeah, <laughs> that uh, it's definitely a potent smell, I would say for sure. Um, you're, you are getting watermelon, 100%, but uh, it's almost like, like a Sour Patch Kid watermelon. I don't know. You're, I'm, I'm definitely getting a very strong candied watermelon aroma. Definitely candy. It almost smells slightly sour. I'm not gonna lie. It almost smells slightly sour. And now that I'm putting a little bit more thought into it as I'm smelling it, it kind of smells like those watermelon sugar candies. I like the watermelon candies. I, 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 I don't remember what they're called, but watermelon sours, I don't know. But that's kind of what it smells like and reminds me of. So I don't drink this flavor too often. Um, I'll give my thoughts in a second. So here we go, guys. Down the hatch. Let's get it. Cheers. Yeah, so overall flavor profile, we're getting artificial candy watermelon. Straight up. Potency wise, I definitely would say for the overall flavor potency, you're getting, I would say a medium to high. So like maybe a six or a seven. Um, like if you're rating from one through 10 on flavor potency, I'd give it a six or a seven. Uh, maybe a 7.5. Um, it's definitely not light, but it's definitely not overly strong. I think it has a nice medium to high balance. I'm going to give it one more sip here, though. You're not getting any real sourness. Um, it's overall generally pretty sweet. Um, I think the sweetness level is really nice, too. Um, you're not getting, like... An overly tart overly sweet just generally sweet um it's it's a very smooth flavor it's a very easy drink as well like if you're not gonna have any like i don't know like you're not gonna get heartburn from this flavor at least i find i don't get heartburn from this flavor it's honestly like honestly a really smooth drink like the mouth feel of this flavor is actually better than a lot of a lot of other flavors um I don't know if it's just me, but certain G Fuel flavors, like some of those up there have completely different mouth feels. If I, I don't know if I'm crazy, call me crazy. I don't know, but a lot of different G Fuel flavors have just, they sit on the tongue differently. So um, that's something to uh, think about next time you guys drink, drink a G Fuel flavor. Compare two, three, four different flavors and kind of see how they feel. Because like, I, I'm telling you, like there's, it's it's a thing i promise <laughs> but uh yeah so it's super smooth the watermelon is super super smooth you're getting like a kind of a, honestly kind of a soft flavor too like it, it feels kind of like soft mellow flavored um generally the flavor kind of honestly mixed kind of well even though i know i shaked it just there but or shook it sorry it mixed pretty well like that's actually really nice it's you, you'll you'll find with a lot of flavors that there is quite a bit of residue no matter how much you shake it at the bottom of your shaker but well, that looks like pretty damn crystal clear i'm not gonna lie like that looks pretty nice sorry i know i don't know if my phone's focusing on me or not excuse me but yeah like that is like an exceptionally smooth drink there um that's pretty nice But through and through, you're kind of just getting watermelon, candy watermelon. But for some of you, that might be fantastic. That might be right up your alley. Um, you're not really getting any natural watermelon taste, in my opinion. Um, I don't know what kind of watermelon G Fuel was necessarily going for with this one. Um, but I would almost be 99.9% .9 certain 
that this is a candied watermelon flavor straight up um i would say this flavor is definitely for a lot of people and i think a lot of people would generally enjoy this flavor i don't think there was a lot of people that would necessarily dislike this flavor unless you don't like watermelon um so would i recommend it definitely i would definitely recommend this flavor especially especially for people that are new to g fuel i think this flavor is perfect for starters um i would actually recommend this over a lot of other flavors uh for newcomers to g fuel like when it, when you're when you're new to g fuel i i in my opinion i think you should start off with the basic flavors and then move your way up to more advanced taste like tastes um uh, but watermelon is just one of those old reliables that you just really can't go wrong with like it doesn't give you like an outstanding otherworldly flavor profile but it gives you exactly what it's supposed to and you really just can't go wrong with it you can so with that being said as uh what i've explained there should justify my rating on this um i definitely like it i like it it's a solid flavor i enjoy it um i'm gonna give this a 7.5 i think it's a 7.5 like it's it, it's a good flavor it is most certainly a good flavor it's generally for 95 percent of the community i would say that i can maybe not quite but it, it's it's going to be a good flavor for the majority of the community and i think it's a very valid flavor um so with that being said i think a 7.5 should be justifiable for this flavor um but let me know if you guys disagree with me in the comment section below um i would definitely like to have a nice discussion um anybody that has their own personal take on this flavor let me know in the comment section below i'd be very curious to share and uh intertwine thoughts on really any g fuel flavor to be honest um but with that being said that has been my review for the watermelon g fuel flavor guys um i definitely went a little bit more in depth with this one today guys um since this was like my first video back in a long time uh, at least a month or so i figured i'd give you side give you guys something a little bit more advanced and in depth here for you guys so um yeah guys that's pretty much been the video thank y'all for watching make sure to uh use code twitchy on gamehive.gg um we also got a twitchy bundle on there as well so make sure to go check that out um 20 different flavors of per my personal favorites so if you guys want to go check it out definitely encourage you guys to do that so that's been it for me guys thank y'all for watching we'll see you guys in the next video adios and take care peace